What am I standing on? I'm standing on an infinite dropper and it's my infinite dropper and I'm going to tell you how to build your own. It's super easy and you're just going to have to believe me on that. All you need is what you see in my inventory. Something to put some tripwire hooks on. Say some grass blocks. Uh, place two tripwire hooks between them and put your piece of string. Now you have the basic trigger. All you need is the command block. I'm going to show you how to get a command block. Type in slash give, enter your username, and then command underscore block. And that will give you a command block. You place it, enter any command you want in here, and once that once uh, the trigger is activated, it will trigger this. Let's say I want to slash give any oh, ball sub apple. And done. Now, once I trigger this, boom, I get an apple. I can eat that apple, but I'm in creative. Boom, just got another one. Boom, 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 boom. I'm super rich on apples right now. Now, see, that's how command blocks works. You just enter whatever command you want, and once something triggers it, you get that command. It's super simple. So what this is, the command is basically just a teleport command, if you haven't already guessed it. It's slash TP at player, uh, nearest player, and then X coordinates, Y coordinates, and Z coordinates. Oh, I'm in W by accident. Uh, yeah, enter that by accident. Okay. Now, uh, here's the the actual thing. Here's the tripwire hook. Make sure these coordinates will teleport you directly above your tripwire hook. I'm going to show you how you can do that easier. Just stack them like this until you get as high as you want. And let's say this is the height I want to teleport to. You can press F3. And as you can see now, over here to the left, X, Y, Z coordinates. Take a picture of that, write it down, do something, make sure you get it, and it make sure it's exactly the same as you see it on here, minus the slash. Uh, after you do that, I'll get it down here first, you're all set. That's everything you need. All you have to do is make sure that the thing is set up properly, and you go in. I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like on the inside. Boom. There I am. I'm falling. I'm going to reach the bottom and teleport right back to the top. And there I am, right back at the top, as promised. You can basically have this go forever and ever and ever. Was it? Was it did I just lag right there? I think I just slowed down. Anyway, you can go for as long as you want, over and over and over again, but it can only be 256 blocks high. Keep that in mind because that's the world size limit. Which, by the way, this reaches. Uh, so this is as high as you can go, but if you want to see more stuff on the way down You can have that tripwire hook teleport you to a second tower that you build and That tripwire hook at the end of that tower sends you to a third one and so on and so on and One little fun thing you can do about this is say you're in, uh, you build this in creative and then you bring all your friends in survival or something and you want to mess with them and say uh, That that command blocks does something uh, Awesome say give you an apple like like I've showed you um, you can trick them into going into it, set it up as a trap or something, and then they'll infinitely fall and it'll be extremely annoying to them because they won't know how to get out. I mean, you can build it to where they can't get out. Um, but of course, in, in mine, there's I, I've built ways for me to get out. Say so, uh, right here. I recommend leaving, uh, leaving a way to get out. Now, I want to show you one last thing. Uh, as you can see, mine reaches to the void. Uh, I'm going to show you why that's an issue. Oh, oh my gosh, I went way too deep in there. Hang on. Get to the top. Almost there at the top. Okay. You can probably see it now. Black stained glass. I have to put something here because from that height, you go straight through the wire and you fall into the void. So I put some glass there. That way you can still see the void and all this other awesome stuff I put in here, which this redstone does nothing. And you just keep falling. So I'm gonna get out and I'm gonna tell you one last thing. I'm gonna do a huge thing and it's a time capsule special. Now what that is is I'm gonna build a time capsule, put some signs in it, and these signs will be messages for our future selves. Once I reach 151 subscribers I will open that time capsule, read all the messages, and uh, it's just gonna be a whole big fun thing. I mean, it's, 
who knows how long it'll be till I get 151 subscribers. So it could be a while before any of these messages are read. Uh, and I know for sure I'll forget at least half of them. Uh, you can leave uh, submissions for these uh, ideas for messages down in the uh, down in the comments below. Uh, I think that about does it. Yep, that does it. I'm just gonna kind of walk around. Go into the void real quick. Goodbye.